exciting. And the gorillas. Just letting them know that everything's alright. Yeah. Yes. We know how. Yeah. So as to get accepted by them. Right. As Anaclet has already started trying to calm the gorillas, I think I'll chip in myself with a bit of gorilla speak. Try again. We have to keep our distance. One of the biggest threats to the mountain gorilla is catching a bug from humans. Not one gorilla has ever survived in captivity because of this. We're in luck. Not only have we found our gorillas, but Agasha, the silverback, is here. He's the guardian of the group, and we're going to have to be very careful around him. He's the leader. He has to make patron. Yeah. Just look at him. Don't worry. Silverbacks are usually gentle creatures, but if they think someone is threatening their group, it's time to make your excuses and leave. They can weigh up to 28 stone and their powerful arms, sometimes six feet in length, can tear a human apart. We've got too close and Agasha starts to move towards us. Everybody up. <coughs> Up, Our guide Anaclet orders us to back off. My natural instinct is to rush, but he warns us to move slowly. Run and Agasha will chase after us. The advice pays off. As we retreat, Agasha relaxes and allows us to stay on his patch. I think he was just letting us know it's his mountain, not ours. Patrolling. Now he's gone back, that's the, yes, that the all clear. Everything is clear, it's fine, no problem. And that is part of his responsibility. I'm glad he doesn't think we're a threat. Yeah, he can't tell it's not a threat. That means he's happy. Good. Yeah. always stay in range of the big fella there. They, they wouldn't go too far away from him. They can't because they need uh, to be protected. And they can hear, they use also hearing, they can tell the, the chief still. Does he make these sounds intermittently then so that everyone yes. else can hear? He can hear, yes. Yeah. It's amazing how peaceful this environment is. You know, and that everything comes through the big silverback male, and if he's content, then the whole group is content. And he, he passed, you know, on this path just in front of us here to make sure that everything was all right and goes back to his original position. It's, you, f you feel like you've been accepted, and uh, the serenity of the group continues. It's wonderful to witness. My encounter with the mountain gorillas has been the perfect end to the first leg of my African balloon adventure. Next time, my journey continues across Zambia and Botswana. I'll see one of the wonders of the natural world, and I'll be getting up close to some big cats. Hello. Hello, my boy.